Welcome to Payments Evolution. In this video, I'm going to show you how to run payroll in under five minutes. To get started, open the left hand menu and click Run Payroll. Your first step is selecting the period for which your employees will be paid. So let's start with a payment date. Typically, you want to choose the last day of the pay period. Then select your pay cycle. Here I'm going with the common bi-weekly option. And finally, your date range. Since I've chosen bi-weekly, this is a two-week period. Click Submit and we will move on to managing your employees' earnings. Here you will find your salaried employees. Now, let's select the employees you want to pay. You can approve them individually or select them all like this. But before moving on, let's add an additional earning. From here, you can select the earnings type. This is a customizable list of additional earnings. I'm going to choose a bonus and give this employee a fixed amount. Then save and approve your additions by clicking here and here. Take a look at the amount you've approved and click Next. And here are your time-based employees. You have three options for configuring them. First is this daily view. You could modify hours worked, add additional earnings, and approve. Second is this familiar bulk view. And finally, with select add-ons, you can import your own timesheets. Approve any hourly earnings and proceed. Now the software is going to calculate your earnings. You'll be asked if you'd like to use company defaults or custom payroll calculations. Your company defaults are the pay rules you've selected. But if you need to add or remove a rule for this specific pay run, then select custom payroll calculations. I'm going to use my defaults. Here you can review your approved payments. There's your employee's gross pay, the deductions, and then their net pay. You can also download this information as a PDF or export to a spreadsheet. When you're satisfied, click Next. It's time to finalize your payroll. First, confirm your payment date from earlier, then your employee payments, and once you're happy with the totals, click Finish. And there's your payroll complete. It's that easy.